Good morning, everybody. It's Midnight and Beyond, welcoming you back to the world of Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we formed an unlikely alliance with the evil King Grangul. He was responsible for killing our sister Emmerine, but unfortunately, we don't really have much of a choice in who our ally is going to be at this point in time. We're all fighting for a common goal of saving the entire world. As for how he works as a support, I have no idea because I've never had him on my team before. He could only talk to Robin, so I assume that's going to be the case with all of the characters that we'll be getting with these paralogues because they're all optional and Robin could just marry them all because they're all Robin sexuals. I don't know what to think of people who have Robin marry Grangle, though that's really stinking weird to me, so I'm not going anywhere near that. And we probably won't even have room to use Grangle on our team all that much because, um, well, we can't even use the characters I already want to use uh, most of the time, so I doubt we're going to be bringing new people in. Uh, but it's just cool to show them off and have them. But now for this conversation with Anna. Mm -hmm. Oh, Robin, just the lady I wanted to see. Oh. Hello, Anna. What can I do for you? Oh. I have a proposition for you. Huh? A proposition? Yes, just this morning I got my hands on a stock of special skin cream. You just smooth it on and the and the wear and tear of battle and travel disappear. Old dry skin replaced by silky smoothness. It's the hard traveling girl's best friend. And today only I could offer it to you at an insanely low price. Um. I see, that's very kind I suppose. But to be honest, I don't use creams and lotions much. They're not really my thing. But a girl's skin is her most important ally. Why, neglecting it is like abandoning a comrade on the battlefield. You're so pretty already. Just think of what a beauty you'll be with a healthy, glowing skin. Hmm. Well, if you put it like that, I suppose I could try a little. Come again. That's the spirit. And here you go. One tub of Anna's Wonder Cream. Um. <laughs> now you've gotten me all excited. I'll have to try it out right now. Great, you do that. Bye! Wait a second, what's this? Oh cripes, I gave her the wrong one! That stuff I gave her is the experimental formula that is still being tested on cows! Well, I guess it'll be alright. I mean, flame tree resin is probably safe and effective on skin, right? And since the sale's been made, I couldn't give her money back, right? No, of course not. All sales are final. Oh boy, I kind of want to see where that one goes. Uh, by the way, I guess any fashionistas out there are just people who know how to take care of themselves. Uh, if you have any actual uh, skin lotion or cream that you would recommend, I would like to know because my face is like infamously dry. Like anytime I uh, go to a salon or whatever to like get my eyebrows done or anything like that, there's always like, you have such sensitive skin, like it's insanely fragile. Herba derba derba derba. Like, well, what do you propose I do so it doesn't like peel off in an instant? And they're just taking tell me they're just like, come again. Oh boy. So now that's taken care of, we'll go to the wireless once again. Bonus box. Uh, go to bonus maps and get this uh new paralog opened up. Uh, but real quick, let me go ahead and check my inventory. I don't know why I need to uh, announce it to you every single time. Okay, kind of unfortunate that we didn't get any uh, other characters uh, have their communications open up, but hopefully we'll get that in due time. Up next is Paralog, Paralog number 19. Let's get started, y'all. Risen, and lots of them. Be careful. I feel a dark power emanating from them. Darker than usual. They resemble the monsters that drove us to the brink of extinction in my future. I feel it too. They seem stronger than we've ever faced before. Perhaps we needn't fight this battle. We're miles from the nearest village. These Risen may never threaten anyone. No. They aren't the only power at work here. There's something else. Something strong. Huh. Um, probably not going to be using Grangle, honestly. I'm Because I know for a fact that I probably don't want to use him in the final battle, so I'm just going to 
not be focusing on him all that much in these extra paralogs, but I would like to give everyone more time if I could switch people out. Switch Noya for Pain, because she's maxed out, so we could do that. Uh, anyone else maxed out? Uh, Tiki is, honestly. I could switch her around if I want to. But no, I want uh, Lucina's communication with her, so no. Uh, Tharj is maxed out. I'm working on her with Long Ku. 16 experience! Good for you, uh, Sayri. Uh... Who came... Someone came close to... Lucina's maxed out. But I'm working on her communication, so I can't... I feel like someone got close in the last chapter, but, like, I missed out on it. I don't know. I guess having pain out is pretty good. Uh, view our map. Who do I want to be pairing up? We'll have... Uh, where is he? My boy Long Ku. He's gonna go with Arja. We'll have... Anna with Robin, because I really want to see how that communication uh, continues, if we could. Even though I just see the, the results of that conversation, I'll be okay with that. Uh, Lucina with Tiki. Uh, we'll have... Basilo and Flavia. And then everyone else is just sort of whatever. Okay, let's get started. Hello. What? Useless husks! Do you bend the knee to me already? Pa! I have no use for blind obedience. I need you to face me! I was driven off the path to conquest, and only blood will see me return to it. Only his blood. Well, what do you know? It's our good old buddy Walmart back in action. Of course, he ended up surviving this ordeal. Now, the way you get him to join you is you just have to make sure that Krom fights him. If you do that, then you'll be good. Uh, so we're going to pair him up with Sumia and she'll fly over to him. We'll have Long Q with Arja, we'll have Tiki with Lucina, Anna with Robin, Flavio with Basilo, uh, Payne with Frederick, I guess, and then Lissa with Sayri. Did we not get... Was there like a different number of people we could bring in this time? Because like, why is it evened out this time and not from last time? It wasn't... We have 15, apparently. Oh, Cherish is alone. I was like, what the fruit? Okay. That makes a bit more sense. So, where are we going, buddies? How about... Uh, let me look at this map if I can. There's a lot of stinking dudes here. Oh, boy. Hopefully, we don't have reinforcements. They're all risen, right? Okay. Guess we'll just start getting rid of them if we can. Uh, we'll have... Let's switch his item to the axe, and we'll wait it out. Then we'll go with Robin. Switch to Anna. Have Sayri out in front so she can kick butt and take names. Uh, Lucina should also be able to do the same, no problem. As should Long Ku. Uh, chair, she could be on treasure. Oh, great, you can't be on treasure duty. Uh, Frederick, head on over here. Uh, do we have any archers? There is an archer! I actually noticed it for once, hooray! Uh, I guess we'll just have you over here, kind of hiding in the shadows if you can. And here we go! Let's see what we got here. Uh, thank you for dodging. Yeah, you challenge your fate, Lucina. You keep on doing that. Maybe it's not a good idea to, like, record the rest of this LP here, because I'm kind of running out of stuff to talk about. It's like, I'm excited, and I just really want to go ahead and do it. Um, it's not super close to the end of March yet, but I definitely want to record this. I'll get to record tomorrow, not today, but I want to get it done, especially before the ep final episode of The Walking Dead, the final season, comes out. I seriously can't even believe that's finally ending that entire series. Like, I don't know what to think of that, because 
like, it's not like just a one-off game where like it was just this one game in the series that I really liked, or just this one game that I really liked. It was just a single experience. It was a series, and it's ending. Like, imagine if Mario just stopped making games or Pokemon. It, uh, I'm sure I would feel like a lot more stressed out or like emotional at that point. But um, it's wow, that's unfortunate. That's really unfortunate. Um. That's incredibly unfortunate. Say Re being the first to die? Yeah, that never happens. Okay, then. And our healer is exposed. Great. Um, but yeah, it's just an insane feeling knowing that there will never be another Walking Dead game, and especially since the company's going gone down under. So, sort of taking it in that this will be my last time with these characters in this universe, and it's going to be an emotional ride, I'll say that much. And of course, I gotta say that again. You're safe with me. You're safe with me. And we got these guys coming on down. It'd be so jerkish if they could land on the sparkly warkly and steal it from us, but thankfully that isn't the case. Thank you for your self healing, Lissa. Oh boy, she's alone now. Uh. Let's go and do that, I guess. So we could get whatever this is. If I could get a critical, or if Robin could just jump in, that'd be nice. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah, double thank you, Robin. How nice. I wonder just how much I could branch out. And we get... A Salif's Blade. Cool. Huh. I guess I got paired Cherish up with Noe at this point. Or with Lissa. God darn it. I'll get their names right eventually. Uh, we'll have Lucina take care of this one. And Lucina is just like going to town with all these criticals. I think that's what her final ability makes happen. That was a sentence. Uh, Lanku. Get rid of this guy. Uh, Lanku can't want to KO a guy. That's not something you see every day. Uh, maybe with a critical and a team up with Arja, perhaps you'll be able to do it. Uh, there you go. I shouldn't have doubted you, buddy. I could always count on you. I'm oh, very close to a level up. Uh, where's Krom? Krom is with Sumia. Huh. I mean, there's a bow user as well. God darn it. I'm going to regret this. I hope so. Uh, thank you for missing. Slay him. Now, let's try to get rid of the guys who are all on top of Krom. A Balmwood Staff. Restores and Jason Analyze HP. Use it to heal the wielder. Oh, I kind of need that for my healer, who dies a lot. Uh, let's get rid of this guy. We got Payne and Frederick teamed up, an unlikely pair, but whatever. Okay. Get that experience. Uh, who's next? Just you two. Um, let's break up the sinking... Noe torture party. Well, you could switch over to Cherish. It's fine. But is there, there is a bow user. Get rid of him. Thank you. Sorry for the bounce of si the bounce of silence. What? With a bit of silence, it was like bit and ounce, a bounce of silence. Uh, at least Tigger would approve, but um, uh, let's go in, do that, I guess. Um, but yeah, I was like scratching my ear and stuff. I was actually kind of worried because, like, I was messing around with my ear the other day, and 69, I was messing around with my ear the other day, and like, it, I don't know what you would call it, like, it sounded like clogged or closed up or whatever I did with it, like, it. Something was out of place, and it felt... Tragic. It 
felt tragic. Oh god. That was unfortunate. These paralogs are going to be really singing tough, it seems. Oh, that's really crummy. But, um, what was I going to say? I was like messing with my ear and like it felt like it like got clogged or something, but there was nothing in it. It was just like, it felt really weird like for an entire day. And I, I was so singing terrified that like I like hurt my eardrum again or something like that. I told the story before, but like I broke both of my eardrums. I don't know how it happened. It was like a physical thing. It wasn't like a vocal thing, but like they physically broke and it was the most painful thing I've ever experienced in my life. The most physically painful thing. A lot of emotional pain that tops it, but we're not going to talk about that. Um, it was really singing terrible, which, like, I couldn't move my jaw at all, because, like, the pain spread all the way to my jaw, and, like, I couldn't breathe, I couldn't eat, I couldn't, like, do anything, it was horrible. It was really singing bad, but, uh, thankfully it went away after, like, a while, but you have to put in this medicine in your ear, and, like, it d your ear isn't just, like, a straight hole that goes into your body or into your head, like you would imagine it would be, like, you put the drops in, like, it just stays in there. And, like, it doesn't go away. You literally have to keep your head tilted the entire stinking time. And you have to, like, just wait for the liquid to disintegrate into your skin. And it took, like, upwards of 12 hours. And by the time that was finally done, you had to put in the other drops uh, for the night shift. It was really stinking annoying. Uh, let's get rid of this guy. Speaking of really stinking annoying, please don't kill Krom. Uh, let's get this out of here. You know, you could make the game just a lot easier for you if you don't use Robin, because, like, you could remove her from the party, and if she dies, then you get a game over just, like, with Prom, but it's weird. I don't know. I guess Robin is always technically, like, the eye in the sky since she's the one telling people where to go and whatnot. Uh, okay. How many more dudes are you going to send our way? So stinking many. Uh, please dodge. Thank you. Oh my god, there's so stinking many. I really wish, like, why can't I use my whole squad? I wouldn't mind having, like, a two-hour video just so I could use all my characters. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. So stinking many risen. There's 17 more that we need to deal with before getting to Walmart. Oh boy, Frederick, you're not looking so hot. I should switch you uh, over to pain. That seems pretty good, but... Um... Cherish was the only one that died the previous turn, so I can't pair Noe up or Lissa up with anyone. I do need to have her heal Krom, though. Uh, let's find him over here. Uh, we'll have... You guys can't really reach any. We can reach this guy down here, though. Um, none of this is really good. Hmm. Guess we'll go with this. Maybe we'll get a critical, and it'll be super awesome. Or, a uh, tag team is also very nice. Or not, when it doesn't actually do what I thought it was going to do. Get rid of this lady. Yo, get rid of this lady. So, like, my voice is... My voice feels fine, but I still seem to be losing it. So, I guess I should turn it in for the night after this. Uh, let's go with pain. Get rid of this guy. Definitely want to get rid of all those stinking bow users. Never a fan of those guys. The only bow I like is the one in Paper Mario. I suppose you tried. But I wish there was, like, a person that... Environment that just attacked with their fists, and I could go smacky, 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 smacky. Uh, we'll go with Krom, I guess. He's like, I want to switch to Sumia so that Krom has protection, but then uh, she's a lot more susceptible to damage, so uh, if she goes down, the Krom will have no shield. Uh, so I'd rather not have that happen. Let's get rid of this guy if we can. I appreciate it, Tharja. Very good. Lanku just remains as awesome as ever. Level 19, only one more level for you, buddy, and then you'll be all maxed out. Uh, let's go here. Uh, well, that goes to zero, so I should do it. Uh, 
very good. Lucina's just a critical machine now, which I very much appreciate. Anyone else? Uh, enemy phase. Oh boy, let's see how many of them go for Lissa. Let's see how, the, how many of them could get to Lissa before she dies. Oh great, attacking from a distance, my favorite. And there she goes. At least she got to heal Krom before she went down. Okay. They going down. I was gonna like consider skipping this game, but I didn't want to like skip another cutscene like I did with that other dude. And I could have like recorded that entire fight again just so I could show that off, but I didn't want to. Uh, now he's doubly angry. Um, but yeah. And, like you can't redo chapters on the world map, which is kind of weird. I kind of wish you were able to do that, but as far as I'm aware, you can't. So I wasn't able to just show that fight again in that dialogue. Anything can change, hooray! And Krom is level 20! Very good, our fearless leader is at his ultimate power. Uh, assuming his Brave Lance broke, no! I'd say even crummier considering I think it did zero damage against that dude. And there goes that guy though. Okay with that. And it goes to level 17. Very, very good. Go. Up next we got a miss and a hit. Uh, a couple of hits right there. And my cat is pooping, which means it's going to smell really sick and bad in here in a few seconds. So I really want to finish up this recording so I can go ahead and uh, use the, the spray of goodness. Because I still haven't gotten odor-free uh, cat litter yet. I really should keep that spray can like just near my sinking computer, so I have to go get up and get it. Uh, but whatever, first of all problems, I guess. I have to get up and walk two feet to get my Febreze that I used to get rid of cat litter, cat poop smell. Why does cat poop smell god sinking off of a dog poop is just fine? Like, I assume it, I don't know, it's just like when I'm taking the dog out for a walk, it doesn't smell bad. Like, I guess I don't sit around to like smell it and wait for the odor to arise, but like, it's like, doesn't smell super terrible from what I remember, but like the cat poop, it smells really stinking terrible, and I don't like it. What a riveting stinking conversation to have like in the epic battle of Fire Emblem Awakening. Oh, he's moving. That's awkward. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Jesus Christ, stop it! Enough! Ugh. Well, Walmart's on the move, because he's a jerk. Yeah, he was all about, like, just going forward, so I gotta keep everyone away, I feel like. He was a vulnerary, I guess, Krom. Everyone else, keep your distance, I guess. Oh, this is gonna be really crummy and annoying. Like, I checked the wiki and it says that he'll join you as long as Krom fights him in the battle. It didn't say defeat him. It's so, like, do I just need to jab him once and then we'll be good? Oh god, all these guys over here. Uh, physical attackers. Get rid of the special and ranged attackers first. Oh, uh, which is all of them. Cool. Uh, let's, well, both of you are level 20 now. Oh, wait, no, Laku isn't level 20 yet. God darn it. Uh, let's see if you could get a critical. Finish this guy off. Or Tharzer could join in as well. That'd be nice. Oh, of course not. That would be way too convenient. Uh, Beastone Plus, can you not do that much damage to her, please? Or to him. Uh, booty up. I appreciate the critical. And 126 damage. Yes, please. I'll have what she's having. Uh, thank Anna can actually one KO person. Hooray. Anna's not all that bad. I don't know why I'm still thinking that. Like, we had a kind of a rough patch at one point, but. 
Uh, that seems to be all ironed out now. She's really stinking useful, and I'm glad that we have her. Uh, let's go with... I guess with Flavia. 69! That seems like a calling, if I ever saw one. Or heard one. I don't know. Thank you for soul! Very good. Get that experience. Who else is there? Oh boy. Can you not kill pain, please? I would very much appreciate it. Didn't. Thank you. Oh god. Okay. Walmart! You survived? No. My heart beats no more. But the flame of life within me refuses to gutter out. This marks the third and final time our blades will cross. What? The war is ended, Walmart. We've no reason left to fight. Craven. We have every reason! A conqueror rules by strength alone! Defeat is death, and I must rise again! Listen to me. That's utter nonsense. The fell dragon is reborn and plans to destroy this world. If you're really so dead set on battle, then fight at my side. Such arrogance. This world is mine. I'll suffer no one to harm what is mine. Be they man, dragon, or otherwise. Then let's strike him down together. Stand up and fight. Words will not divert my course. Only steal. If you would claim me, draw your blade and make it so. Fine. We could fight again, but when I defeat you this time, you will join my cause. If you don't kill me right here, 41%. Thank you. Oh boy. So is that enough now for them to join or does Krom need to defeat him? I'll just have him beat him just for safety measures. I would just appreciate if all of you weren't going for him. Thank you for constantly missing, though. Uh, I don't know what weapon she's currently using, but it wasn't enough to finish them. Oh, boy. Hope so. Thank you. Zero percent chance. Okay, we're good. Oh, they're still going for them. 46%. Thank you. Just all looking at all those numbers. Just keep on hoping. This game is like 50% hoping, 50% uh, sexy chess pieces. <laughs> Uh, thank you, Robin, for just getting in on the backup. Okay, Anna gets to level 18. Very good. I may actually get her to 20 in this fight. That'd be amazing. Okay. Yeah, as I'll ever be. I appreciate all the constant missing. And one more hit for Krom, it seems. Thank you for missing! And I also appreciate the healing! Yay! Oh boy. Let's hurry up and make it our turn so we could get a new sinking party member. Thank you for guarding. And oh boy, one more. I'll try. There you go. Awesome power duo. Guys, sword looks completely different. Looks like a singing laser sword. Singing amazing. Uh, thank you for dodging. And we're good. I wish you could defeat him one hit. Aww. Uh, Lucina get attacked from it? Oh, wait, no, she can't. Um, I guess if you don't kill him, then that's fine. Just weaken him for us, okay? In this land, I have crushed a multitude of Risen and made them my own. You snuffed my dreams of conquest. I dare you now to snuff the spark of life within my breast. Okay, great. This writing is just amazing. Like painting the wall with my lunch and stuff in my breast, whatever. Okay. Ouchies. Krom, can you finish him off? Not quite. God darn it. Unless you get a critical. No one else could reach him, right? 
Let's hope for a critical. Hope for a miracle. So, he can't join us for this fight, unfortunately, but he is our new ally, it seems. Now we just gotta clean up his mess. How wonderful. Uh, we'll have Lanku up here. Or not. Lanku is almost level 20. Just finished off this guy and we should be good to go. Unnecessary, uncritical is unnecessary, but very cool anyway. Uh, not there quite yet. What ofs? Uh, Frederick. Oh, pain could kill them. How about Frederick with a beast killer? Doesn't look like it. Um. Let's go with this guy then. Thank you. Okay, so the main stressful part is out of the way, but like, what if it's like, Krom needs to hit Walmart and not kill him in order to have him join them be like, oh, you hit me with your sword. Okay, I guess I'll join you now. I really hope it's not that specific. Because in the, on the wiki, it said just have Krom fight him. It didn't say defeat. So I really hope we end up getting him. I'm going to be really stinking mad if we don't. We have to do this again. Uh, Anna. I guess Brave Sword. Go and do that, and that, and a little bit of that. Uh, very close, but it will. Enemy phase. There's only seven left. Let's see if we get any uh, taken down in the counterattack. If they don't take us down first, that is. Okay. This is just giving me perspective of what the final battle is going to be like. I remember it being stinking deadly. And for Frederick, I would be shocked if he survived this. No. I am defeated. That would be a really crummy end to this if we have all of our guys die right now. So can you guys not keep on following? We have 10 more guys. We should be fine. I hope so. Oh, Crumb's still out in the front. Oh, jeez. Anna, get rid of this guy. Make something good happen today. Thank you. Come again. Get that experience. Okay, go for Flavia. Someone who isn't Krom. Hooray. Dodge that. And... Let's... Oh, God. Okay. Please, 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 please. We have one more. One more. Oh, God. Not from a distance. 22%. Please don't hit him. Thank you. Jesus. Okay, player phase, let's go. Uh, switch to loot. Oh wait, they're both maxed out. So it doesn't matter, cool. Uh, go with Lucina then, cause she'll take him now. Go and do this, now that I'm finally done having my stinking heart attacks. Or maybe not! Okay, good, thank you. Uh, go with Krom? No. Uh, let's just get out of here then. Uh, switch to Sumia, stay in the back. Then we'll have Anna, I guess he'll take care of this guy. Ready? Go for that. And another level up for ya. Level 19. Uh, but yeah, this is giving you like kind of an idea of how terrible the final battle is going to be in terms of difficulty. I remember it being a very big pain in the booty. But then again, I got to the final battle without uh, upgrading a single character's class throughout the entire adventure. And like only in the final battle was I like required to because my characters did no damage. 
Uh, but somehow I pulled it off. It's a stinking miracle that I managed to make it work in the end. Let's see if we get some criticals in here, or if Tharja could just help out. Oh, uh, we are... G Jesus Christ, Longku, you're amazing. And that's a very good attack to make you go to level 20. Just seem better. He's like, come on, Longku, you could be proud of yourself and all that you've done. Uh, I guess we'll go with Hector's Axe. It's the best item for her, it seems. Uh, okay. Any other characters? Nope. Two more. Just dodge that, please. Or you could die, I guess. That's always fun. It was a close battle, to be sure, but at least we made it out okay. Uh, now, let's see. What are you going to do? Can it hit us? No, you're not. Okay. Can't take him out. Oh, uh, with either weapon. Oh, uh, we have a better chance with this one, though, as long as we get a critical, possibly. Should be good to go. Or if Tiki just jumps in as well, that would be nice. Dodge it. And... Okay, there you go. Uh, Tiki's Dragonstone plus Broke, but that's okay, because we could buy more. Uh, speaking of buying, let's get our favorite little merchant to finish off this Valkyrie and possibly reach level 20. Eh, not quite, but we have finished the Paralogue, and that's good enough for me. You gave your word, Walmart. Now fight with us. First, I must know how you defeated me. I have never lacked for strength. No. You're far stronger than me. Even now, I think that's true. But you stand alone. My own strength is but a fraction of the strength I wield. My allies hone and temper me. They boost my morale and guide my actions. <sighs> you tread the path of kings. You rule by winning hearts. I rule by winning battles. We are opposites, you and I. I cannot change. I tread the path of the conqueror, and conquerors walk alone. However, I am curious to see just how far your kingly path can lead you. My lord. The wounded have been treated, and the horses loaded. We should hurry on. The path of the conqueror. Yes. My lord? No. Sorry, just thinking out loud. You know, honestly, I'm a bit jealous of Walmart. He stands for strength above all things. He has no regrets, no doubts. He's a juggernaut that charges forward and mows down whatever gets in his way. I'm not like that. My steps are often plagued with question and worry. Perhaps such emotions are part of the parcel of your path, my lord, not obstacles to it. Hmm? How do you mean? Ah. The doubtless man's path is straight, but not always true. A juggernaut does not pause to correct trajectory, it merely presses on. But by stopping, doubting, and occasionally doubling back, you keep a truer course. I could not serve a conqueror, my lord. And I pray you not think prudence a flaw. <clears throat> Thank you, Frederick. Shall we then? Not at all, my lord. Mm. Of course. Forward. For now. We've got another unlikely but insanely powerful ally on our side. But we're not done yet. We still need more help in order to defeat the fell dragon. Next time on Fire Emblem Awakening, you'll be in for quite a treat. This is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.